The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. It's Advent prayer time. We gather on Thursdays knowing that others gather with us for common prayer from our homes, offering our prayers for our world, our community, prayers for all those we said we'd pray for, prayers for vision and resolve and direction. And it's a comfort to know that others are praying with us, for us, and for our community. So we thank you for your prayers. We trust that God hears our prayers, that God responds, and we believe that the Spirit helps us to pray with sighs too deep for words. And as we pray, we also listen. We listen with ears to hear, with ways to respond. To begin our prayers together, hear God's presence in the words of the psalm, Psalm 34, verses 1 to 8. I will bless the Lord at all times. The praise of God shall ever be in my mouth. I will glory in the Lord. Let the lowly hear and rejoice. Proclaim with me the greatness of the Lord. Let us exalt God's name together. I sought the Lord who answered me and delivered me from all my terrors. Look upon the Lord and be radiant, and let not your faces be ashamed. I called in my affliction, and the Lord heard me and saved me from all my troubles. The angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear the Lord and delivers them. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Happy are they who take refuge in God. Here ends our psalm. We begin our time with a simple prayer. Let us pray. Lord, you are the bread of heaven, giving life to the world. You fill our emptiness with goodness. You come to our weakness with your strength. Take and use our prayers and gifts to bring in a rich harvest of your heavenly food and life-giving refreshment. Amen. Together, we offer our prayers this evening. 